Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we will discuss blended axis in Tableau. Before starting this video, if you have not subscribed to the channel, hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon for upcoming and interesting video. So without any further delay, let's get started. So what is blended axis? So blended axis is used to compare two or more measures at a same axis. This is mainly used when we need to use two or more measures or multi-line graphs or chart. When we use blended axis, same chart will be applied to all measures that we use in our view. Unlike in uh, dual axis that we discussed in previous video, we can use different chart for different measures, but here uh, same chart will be applied to all measures. Okay, so let's see how we can create blended axis in Tableau. I'm using sample super data dataset for this video. I will provide the link in the description box to download this dataset. So let's create blended axis for this. I'm using order date and let's convert into continuous month and let's drag our profit and sales. Now you can see both sales and profit are showing at different axis so how we can combine them and make a blended axis so for this you can go to here hold it and drag it to the profit axis or you can go to here and drag it to the sales axis okay so this is how you can create blended exit axis and second method is just replicate it and drag profit so instead of dragging sales into rows what we can do is we can just hold sales and drag it to the axis okay so you can see we have replicated the same view but using different method okay this is our second approach and uh, from here you can see when uh, after dragging both sales and profit name of the axis has changed so you can rename it as sales okay and here you can see profit is represented by blue color and sales is represented by orange color okay so now we'll add a few more measures to analyze how blended access will help to analyze our data okay now let's add discount as well profit ratio as well and quantity as well okay so as you can see each measure is represented by different color so let's suppose i don't want to add sales so you can see the axis has changed now okay and if if you want to uh, remove profit as well so you can see axis has changed now okay so now let's analyze how blended axis will help to compare our measures okay if we check for this particular month that is january 2020 so our profit is decreased that is to minus 3190 and if we check our quantity so quantity sold for jan is 260 and if we check our data for november 2020 so our profit has raised to 12.5k and our quantity sold is around 1.3k okay so this is how you can analyze and measures in which month our profit is going down and how, how much quantity being sold okay and what is our profit ratio and how much discount we are giving okay let's take one more example of blended axis for this let's use subcategory with sales and profit so now you can easily analyze what is the sales and profit for each subcategory okay so from this you can make stack bar chart as well for this just drag measure name into color and you can see a stack bar chart is created and here orange color represent sales and blue color represent profit okay let's add their label as well so now you can see for each category how much sales and how much profit okay if you want to move sales to the upper side so you can just hold it and move it here so now you can see sales is coming upside and profit is coming downside okay this is how you can use blended axis 
थैंक यू सो मच गाइज इफ यू लाइक द वीडियो प्लीज डू लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब एंड स्टेट यून फॉर अपकमिंग वीडियोज